Korkoron Hills in Tandare Valley in Baringo South were once bandits' hideouts where they staged attacks, killed people, and stole thousands of livestock. The area is now breathing with life gradually. My bandits will go and see me at Korkoron and buy me see me, see me at him, let me out. Now what will go? My mama got sick, let me tamba my chungu yuko. If you make use, you will salama to go to Lewa na idara ya maskari na tunaweza tunaona sasa hii usalama imerudi kidogo This is Riverside Center in Kasela where seven people were shot dead by bandits in one day Business is now slowly coming back Marigat Muchongoi Road had also remained impassable for a while for fear of being ambushed on the way it was at the height of these attacks that led to mass displacement of people who had to flee to the upper Muchongoi, Bechot, Sandai, Marigat and others as far as Laikipia. When the government launched the police KDF joint security operation and made an addition of 200 police reservists in Baringo North and Baringo South, guns have since gone silent and there is life again. Unajua hao hao mapandits walikuwa na mapunduki na hii watu wetu hawakuwa na masuala yote ni watu wa amani. So wakati walifamia eneo hili, mimi nilikuwa mmoja wao ambao nilikimbizwa isipokuwa tu Mungu wangu hakuwa ame Ameniacha. Slowly, residents are returning back to areas of Sinoni, Seretion, Lomulel, Embosos, Arabal, and Kasela at the foot of Korkoron Hills. The locals have now ventured into farming activities, growing different types of crops, after realizing that livestock keeping is not the only way to have a source of income. Ikiendelea hivi, watu watawesa kukuja wote, waishi upu. Baringo County MP Florence Jematia lauded the Ministry of Interior for deployment of security forces who have restored calm in the area. We have people from Kasela who have gone home, Arabal area, Wamerudi Nyumbani, Korkoron, areas that was a, a no-go zone. The governor will tell you here that people have already go to those areas and they are trying to settle. Apart from God, I want to say the president of Kenya is a dear to Baringo. And I don't want to complain all the time. When it is a favor from God, we have relative peace, we say thank you. The challenge here remains the housing component as their residences were vandalized. As their lives start to normalize, their major appeal is for government to provide them with iron sheets for rebuilding back their houses. Tunaomba kabisa mapati au watu kabisa wachenge ujua wana namna ya kuchenga manyumba sao. Winnie, Twitter Week, K24 TV.